Hi, I'm Besat Meskini and I want to show you new method or I can say new tricks for create drainage system in the project. Some uh, sort of modeling like this or like this. I saw a lot of people, then all of them using model in place so, but I create this model with the basic one um, I can say this is very fast method for create this type of modeling in the project and very easy to communicate with this method and one important thing is about the information if you use modeling place tool for this type of modeling in the project all of the information then you have is volume but if you use this method the final result you can have length you can have uh, all of the information about the location line, top constraint or base constraint or something like this and you can manage very fast, very easy uh, your model. I want to show you how you can create this type of model. Uh, the normal way is use model in place so for example direct model sweep sketch pan you can use radius and uh, something like this select profile load profile uh, r9 profile and r9 profile for fitting and something like this if you finish this model you can see what you have volume just this very simple without any information but the important thing is about the length or uh, sometimes I can say you need to count the part for this okay let's see how we can create this type of drainage system in the project this is very simple in fact i use the basic wall here some sort of generic model generic uh, 200 millimeter basic wall and i use the applicate drainage and preview edit section view and I want to change the height for sample wall to one meter and I want to change the thickness for this wall to 1.2 meter and then I change the material concrete cast in place like this after that I can try to use reveal here in fact I prepare a section for reveal before of this movie and I can use that section R9 I can change the construction the constraint for this uh, profile from top and can change the offset value minus 0.6 meter or something like this here. Okay. You can see what happened. 
when I use the reveal in in the wall and after that I can use a split region for create some part here and here uh, like this uh, like this and I can change the dimension for this one like this okay everything is okay and I can go to the project area and try to create this type of ball in my project as you can see this is very fast and very uh, very powerful for to uh, create this type of model and you can create your plan everywhere and every shape then you want and if you need to create some branch from the main line you can use wall and create something like this but uh, you have some problem here for connection between two lines and you can fix this problem very, very simple if you want to fix this problem you can use fitting some sort of fitting like mechanical uh, system okay I want to show you another example here then you can see what happened when we use this type of modeling or I can say this method for modeling you can see how much is fast and if you need to create branch from this main line you can use some sort of fitting family as you know we have uh, dark system or pipe system in our project and when we want to create new branch from the main line we can use uh, some sort of uh, we can use a fitting family in the dark or pipe system and now we can use a simple family like fitting here everything then you need is a component cross type or uh, I can say Y W Y E type I can load W Y E type fiddle here and you can see how much is fast to use this type of fitting in the project then you can join between this model here and here okay if you want to create cross here for example this is the same like T then you can use another fitting for cross for example here cross type like this and you can change the angle value for the fitting to something like this 
this and after that you can use join command uh, you have something like this in the project all things is very simple and as you see we have good information good manageable system or constraint something like this and uh, you can use trim and extend to uh, very simple for example I can use extend here to extend this two wall together extend here uh, like this like this or you can use fillet here as you see it's, it's very fast you can use align tool or you can use copy uh, from here like this and this is more more than faster from the modern place as you see this is very fast and I wish uh, you use this type of modeling this method in your project and you give me a lot of feedback uh, about the problem or about the ability of this method I will be very glad to hear from you and oh I forgot something oh sorry I forgot something here uh, as you know we have uh, create part command here and as you see I try to uh, create some split in the wall and now I can use create part you can see what happened it's very good for presentation uh, it's very good like this and like this oh, it's very good this is another ability for this type of modeling uh, except uh, except the uh, modern in place so okay this is the final things then I want to say thank you for watching this movie good luck